Do you like buffalo sauce and blue cheese? Check out this creation I just made. We're gonna start out with one pound of peewee potatoes and one pound of Brussels sprouts into some boiling water. After about 10 minutes, we'll go on and start fishing out our Brussels sprouts. Set those to the side. And another five minutes later, we're gonna strain our table. Add them to our cast iron. Go in with some avocado oil. Now it's time for the Dano's cheesening. That's the cream top. We're gonna add a bunch of that. Then we're also gonna throw in some of the black top. That's the crunchy. Now we got everything nice and coated. Let's go into our 425 degree oven. All right, so it's been 20 minutes in the oven. Look at that, all the cheesening and the crunchy. Now we got it in our little serving dish. That's good by itself, but we're not done yet. Get you some of your favorite buffalo sauce, and we're just gonna go right over the top. Now we're gonna use four ounces of blue cheese. We're using St. Agar. Take this blue cheese, break it up with our hands. It doesn't really crumble. This is more of a creamy blue cheese. It's an intense blue cheese. And there you have it, folks. Now it's time to get a bite. We'll get me a little tater, a little Brussels sprout, and a little blue cheese. So I was totally winging this, and it totally works. The blue cheese is an intense blue cheese, but with the buffalo sauce in there, and you got your potatoes and Brussels sprouts and the cheesing and the crunchy, it all works together. That's me just freestyling in the kitchen. If you want to see more videos like this, let us know in the comments. Hit the follow button, and we'll see you next time. You guys, you know I love you. Keep sprinkling. Yum, yum, get yourself.